nine months since the last time I was here. Remember this bin? I used to throw my bag of poo in. I lived in the lodge no longer. Well, look at this bus shelter. <laughs> Free books and a yellowtail merlot. Now, not many people watched season four. But those who did really enjoyed it. And you remember there the horses in the field and we're coming up to, oh yes, that's where I spent last winter. Oh, it's good to see it again. The number of times I walked down that road to fetch water, to bring back here. Nice touch. Oh, and a shed in the garden. This is beautiful. Ah, I spent many happy hours just staring at that forest over the winter. Right, time to leave Brandon. Oh, one more thing. Get some water from the church. And uh, Sorry, Desmond O'Brien. Um, you're only available on weekends, and I'm here during the week. Unlucky, but I got uh, Chap Wayne I'm going to meet next. Magnificent Wimdom Abbey. Yeah, just got enough time to clean my teeth. Hello, Wayne. How you doing? Hey, good to meet you, man. You too. Yeah. <laughs> there, it is. there it is. That's got me all around the country. 50 miles a gallon. Yeah. That solar panel. That's much bigger than it looks on the <laughs> YouTube videos. 
Yeah, great. I've now got it connected up to the engine on a split relay, so even in the winter now I can charge up my batteries. Nice. That's awesome. Yeah. Oh! A few little bits and bobs for oh, you. Oh, sweet! Thank, thanks, Wayne. You're very welcome. Yeah, so are you van lifing yourself? No, no, no. Just, we just use it as day out trips and stuff. Yeah. But it is round the corner. Oh, right. So we're going to have a look at it oh. at some point, shall we? Oh, Wayne. It's bought me all the major food groups there. We've got obviously Texas barbecue Pringles with uh, extra mature cheddar cheese, a Swiss roll and Cornish pasty at the bottom. Excellent. Nice one. Wayne. Yes, sir. Uh, another COVID hit for me. I am. Um, Was it COVID or government action? Government. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. So you you, you you were never sick and ill. No one you ever knew was sick and ill. No, Usual story. No, yeah. none at all. Yeah. But I lost, <laughs> well, to all of my business. Uh, the one that I worked so hard for six years. Mm. Six years and, and overnight. Gone. It was gone. Not allowed to meet any customers. No. You are saying you had to um, just take on smaller jobs. That's it. Yeah. I mean, any anything I can get my hands on, really. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but yeah, this, uh, I've been massively hit and I don't think there's even going to be a way back, to be honest. Not for me, not in the business I was in. It's going to take years, well, if it ever happens, it's going to take years. Do you, do you think uh, British industry has been completely destroyed by what the government's done in the past couple of years? Absolutely. Yeah. 100%. 100%. And it's, mm. it's sad. Yeah, it's it sad. is. So what are you doing now? Obviously not, not your career job. What have you chosen to do? Just keep going. Um, I'm working with children, actually. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah. What, play groups, that sort of that thing? That kind of thing, yeah. yeah. School clubs, um, things like that. But I, it's just nothing, uh, you know, full-time where I'm earning the money that I need to earn. Yeah. And this is the thing, you know. I'm, I've tried to stay positive about it, but... Yeah, I just it's been so much damage has been done that it's for me it's kind of where do I go from here? What do I do from here? Well, <laughs> my answer was just to you know get a small van and go around the country <laughs> meeting people like yourself and finding out just what the hell's going on, you know? Yeah, so it's, uh, this isn't about a virus, is it? Quite clearly, this is there's another reason why they're doing this, absolutely. Yeah, I agree. And uh, if you if you want to know why our government would destroy our country, along simultaneously with every government in the world destroying their respective countries, except China, mm. then uh, go and watch on BitChute. Because I can't, I just can't tell you here because this video will get taken down, mm. and I'll get a one week uh, ban. Of course. Yeah, but if you haven't, if you haven't figured it out yet, then. <laughs> You've probably taken a lethal injection and you'll be gone soon, unless you really look after your health. Talk to people who have been there, done it, and what it's done. Yeah. To my life. Yeah, if, if you haven't been... I haven't been yeah. ill. No, no, no. Well, I've, I've had a couple of flus, but then, you the know... Usual flu. Yeah. Nothing oh, out of the Yeah, and oh, do you know what? <laughs> But I didn't report it to any hospital because there, no, there was no flu last year, apparently. Isn't mm. that strange? And yet... As, as all the flu disappeared, another thing came along, which they labelled you-know-what. And h how mysterious is that? Yes. Yeah. Very odd, that. Odd. <laughs> Got to be careful I don't do another tour of Wimbledon, because this is so pretty. Yeah. So pretty. Well, oh, don't want to do the, the tour of Wimbledon again. Although, what a beautiful old town. So much history here. Cheers, That's a life. Cheers. Oh, oh, no. <laughs> Are you sure we don't waste any? So Wayne and I have been discussing things that you can't talk about on YouTube, but I can tell the world that Wayne is awake. And those of you who know what awake means, know what that means. And those of you who are asleep, 
If you want to know what's going on in the world, just get injected and get your opinions from BBC and go back to sleep. I'm working on this theory that the kind of people who figured out what's going on aren't the t aren't TV watchers. Yeah, they don't have their opinions given to them. And yeah. No TV. No. How long have you been without TV, Wayne? Ooh. Nearly three years now. Three years without TV. So, years. so sometimes sort of during the Trump era, was that what woke you up to it the was. fake news? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. That's when it all started. Yeah. 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 Was it the Russia conspiracy theory? You thought this is nonsense. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. So what was it? You can probably say it on YouTube. What was your exact moment that woke you up to the, all this nonsense being nonsense? The lies. The continual lies. Yeah. It doesn't add up. Yeah. It doesn't add up. If it doesn't add up, you've got to think about it. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Yeah, it doesn't add up. Have a think. Absolutely. Yeah, think about what does add up. Mm. Which possible story could overarch all current events that does add up? Could it be a bio warfare cull? Hmm? Hmm? A long planned bio warfare cull? Hmm? Does that add up? Does that explain current events? Hmm? Mm. <laughs> Oh, have I got you in there? Yeah, there you are. Oh. Don't watch TV. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> kid, Manchester Van Life. Wayne's a fan of yours and he's got some advice for you. Come on, our kid. You can do it. You can do it. You need to get out there, live life, enjoy life. Mm. Yeah. You can do it. Yeah, I believe in you, our kids. We believe. Yeah, you got this.